C. James 2 8 13. 8 If, however, you are fulfilling the royal law according to the scripture, you shall love your neighbor as yourself, you are doing well. 9 But if you show partiality, you are committing sin and are convicted by the law as violators. 10 For whoever keeps the whole law, yet stumbles in one point, has become guilty of all. 11 For he who said, Do not commit adultery, also said, Do not murder. Now if you do not commit adultery, but do murder, you have become a violator of the law. 12 So speak, and so act, as those who are to be judged by the law of freedom. 13 For judgment will be merciless to one who has shown no mercy, mercy triumphs over judgment. I was told that the book of James is a summary of what Jesus preaches at the Sermon on the Mount from what is written in Matthew chapter 5, 6 and 7. When James talks about fulfilling the royal law, he means the Ten Commandments and Jesus went into more detail of the Ten Commandments during his Sermon on the Mount. After Jesus delivers what is called the Beatitudes of his great sermon, he says let your light shine, but we let our light shine by sharing God's love and mercy with all humanity. Jesus tells the church not to destroy the law, but fulfill it and James tells the church you fulfill the royal law when we love our neighbor, as ourselves. James continues his message of not showing partiality to any individual or any group. There are many groups that exist both past and present, that say the Lord God is only their God and salvation is only there. Some of these groups who believe in God but believe He is only their God are the, the Ku Klux Klan and Black Hebrew Israelites. For any group of people to believe the Lord God Creator of the universe and Creator of all human race is only their God makes no sense to anyone just read a few scripture of the Holy Bible. Genesis 1 27 So God created man in His own image, in the image of God He created him, male and female He created them. John 3 15 So that everyone who believes will have eternal life in Him. 16 For God so loved the world, that He gave His only Son, so that everyone who believes in Him will not perish, but have eternal life. One of commandments of God that James quotes is the is the sixth, you shall not murder, commandment. Jesus went into more detail on how a thought the six commandments can be broken, without even killing another individual, and it is by hating anyone that we do not favor or who we are not partial to. 1 John 3 15 Everyone who hates his brother or sister is a murderer, and you know that no murderer has eternal life remaining in him. A person would have why would God create a whole world of different races of people, a kaleidoscope of people so that only one race would have salvation? Both the KKK and the Black Hebrew Israelites teaching is based on a pride issue, but say God is only Lord of people, that is salvation based on DNA that is James says is a sin of partiality and hate. Dear Beloved, Let's free our image from the thought of hate, personal pride, let's have less love for self and more love for God and all the children He made in His image. God bless you and the Lord Jesus loves you and so do I Samuel H. 1 Peter 4 7 The end of all things is near, therefore, be of sound judgment and sober spirit for the purpose of prayer. 8 Above all, keep fervent in your love for one another, because love covers a multitude of sins. 9 Be hospitable to one another without complaint.